know today's video will be about lash extensions the main products that i will be using are from v eyelash and can we just talk about the packaging you will need some tape and guys i am so excited because i will be showing you a few different ways you can use this tape now if you're wanting to stay organized definitely use this under ipad to help you with mapping now this packaging is awesome it has the wand to help you brush out your lashes as well as the brush to help you clean your lashes and also a glue holder now i highly suggest to have a lash remover just in case of emergency or if you're not happy with the style and this product here is awesome because you can actually use this to help you remove the product a lot quicker now I do have the professional lash glue, but today I will be using the Ardell Lash Adhesive. I highly recommend to get a pointed and curved tweezers. These are awesome because they are longer than usual, um, which makes you more comfortable when applying your own lashes. This last tray comes with 8 millimeters to 16 millimeters in length. The thickness is 0.15 and these are level C curl. First step you want to do is apply the under eye pad over your natural bottom lashes to help prevent getting any glue on your bottom lashes. I think this is awesome. And on top of that, this can also be used to help you with mapping. Depending on your style you are going for, mapping is great to help you determine the length for each section you create. I'm going to take this tape and apply it underneath my eyes because I do have a few bottom lashes sticking out and you want to do the best you can to avoid getting glue on your bottom lashes. As you can see, I am using this tool here just to help me determine my section here. You want to be able to create the sections depending on your style you are going for as you can see i am planning to go on a open eye round style so i have 13 in the inner and outer corner and 15 in the center the next technique that i will be doing is applying tape to the center of my eyelid and pull that upward this would allow me to have a, a better visual of my natural lashes now, if you've seen my previous lash extension videos, I like to start off by applying the lashes underneath my real lashes and then I'll slowly apply on top of my natural lash as well.
so glad I decided to do a shorter length for you guys and I definitely do enjoy this look because it gives you that wispy style and yes guys I will link everything down below be sure to check them out if you haven't and guys leave your questions or comments down below and I'll be sure to answer every single one of them and again guys you guys are amazing I'll see you guys next time bye